Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing great today and that you're having a lovely day. If this is your first time here, let me introduce myself. My name is Dora and what we're going to be doing today in the Diary of a Greek Mum is this well overdue video of me refreshing and redecorating the bathroom of my office. And it's why you can actually see a shower right behind me. So I'm standing right in front of the door of that bathroom and we're going to go in and I'm going to take with me that big bag of stuff with everything I've purchased and I've shown you in all of those previous hauls within the last month and start redecorating and refreshing. Pretty much, actually it's more like putting an identity to that bathroom because it's very plain, very, very boring. I'm going to insert a clip here where you can see how it was before and how, why I'm calling it boring because it's literally just plain white walls and a toilet, a sink, a unit above it and the shower. <laughs> So, um, without further ado, if you're interested in decorating, ideas about what you can do to refresh your own home or to refresh your bathroom, then grab yourself a beverage, a refreshment, coffee, tea, I'm going to get myself a coffee and let's get stuck in. Let's go. So this is the bathroom and the very first thing that I want to do before I even start bringing things in is kind of do a quick clean. I have deep cleaned this bathroom about, I want to say a week ago. So I don't really need to go in and do all the heavy stuff, but I do want to give it a good refresh before I bring anything in. So how do I do that? I am going to use my absolute favourite, ever since I bought them they are my favourite, Dettol Wipes. And these ones in particular are pomegranate and lime splash. They smell so nice and I'm not going to only clean, I'm going to bring that little lovely smell of these in this room so when I actually start decorating the room's going to smell even better. So yeah, let's get started with these. <laughs> Oh, 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 
right, so this is the bag that I got with all of the stuff that are gonna go in here. It's quite heavy actually, but I've put all of the stuff that I need in here and I'm gonna leave this bag in here as well because I'm gonna use it as a basket in a way right underneath my sink so I can store a few things. So let's go and start emptying some of these. So we've put a few things out already and I wanted to quickly show you this. So this is the Madagascan Vanilla that I put from Primark. It's already at its end because I had opened it and used it in here before I even started filming this. I'm going to have to replace it soon. And this is a pop that I bought from B&M quite some time ago. It was grey. Uh, if you've watched my video where I cook when I uh, did the leek and feta filo pie, I'm going to link it up here for you to find then you will see uh, one of these on the shelf right above the kitchen behind me that has like a grey silvery grey pot it was how it was bought and I just spray painted this because I wanted it to fit in here so that was just like a very quick DIY and um, so far that's how we're looking so we have these there that one down there that you've already seen the wild sign that I had on the top of the toilet went on the top of my mirror and I'm going to put it slightly down as well so it's more visible. There we go and the other wall so far is looking like this but I want to go ahead and show you I had shown you these that I bought from B&M and currently on that door I have this here which I got from Primark some time ago but the problem with this one is that I have it well I had it previously in my bedroom and I need it back there because it has more hooks and I want it for our robes and for other things that I hang in the bedroom so this is going to be gone from here and I'm going to replace it with them ones so they're going to be closer to the same style of what we're doing in the bathroom Okay, so now they are where they're meant to be and I can hang my hairdryer up here as well. I had also shown you when I picked it up this little gorgeous bath mat from B&M and that is down now. I wish if this was my place that would have been done but this is not my responsibility. You can see this is fantastic and then these are not in the best of places. And the same goes for this, but like I said, this is not my house. I'm not the owner, I wish I was. These uh, wouldn't be existing, but hey ho. So this is down and what is left is for me to put these in place and then show you the end result. 
so let's go ahead and do that. All right, so everything is finished and done and let me show you how it looks now. We have, as you can say, yeah, ignore the puppy that is asleep in the background, but these are on their place now and I have my hair dryer and my bath towel hanging here and going in, you can see now that I have the new pot and the new soap dispenser over there. My wild sign has gone on the top and the Dettol wipes are right next to it. And going to the actual loo, this area, I wish I could change that. I'm gonna paint the color because I hate the fact that because it's been exposed to the sun, it's yellowy, but I'm gonna paint it very soon. Um, I've put this one here like you've seen in the Madagascan vanilla right next to it. I got a pink towel along with the same theme. We've got these on the top. And of course I have the bath mat right underneath and I'm gonna put two pictures right next to each other so you guys can see how it was before and how it's looking now. I really hope you enjoyed this video guys and if you did then give it a thumbs up also if you're not a part of this community yet don't forget to subscribe hit that subscribe button the notification bell right next to it which actually is under there for you to find and that way you'll become part of this community and also be notified whenever i upload a new video so up until the next time i see you toodles